what's going on everyone Mike O returning with another video this is actually gonna be a first for me I'm actually doing a for sale video I just uh, went through some stuff and found out found some uh, autographed items I had uh, from past Phillies events these are all from Phillies charities 95% uh, of them have the authentication logos from MLB and it's just some extra stuff that I was gonna look to uh, try and unload and sell if anyone is interested so first up right here is a Mike Adams autographed baseball um, and you can uh, it's got the authentication logo there so uh, you can comment below if you're interested or go ahead and send me a private message or whatever on there if there's any items that you're interested in uh, I'd also be willing to do trades and stuff like that as well so uh, you can take advantage of that so Mike Adams was first up also got Michael Martinez Michael Martinez signed baseball this is actually one of the few ones that does not have the authentication logo on it the rest of them do uh, got Danny's Baez There we go. Nice and focused up. So Danny's Baez also with the authentication logo sticker. Obviously these baseballs retail for anywhere from $15 to $20. Um, I'm asking like $8 a baseball. So, uh, you know, I'm willing to talk. Obviously I need shipping too. Uh, shipping is going to be a cost and we can decide on that. This is Rich Doobie. It's a pitching coach for the Phillies. He's also coached for a few other teams. I think he had a short playing career as well. Again, authentication logo is on that one there. Yeah. Brian Schneider, who played all over the NL East, played with the Phillies, the Mets, the Washington Nationals, Montreal Expos. So, Brian Schneider, authentication logo, on that one as well. Got Lance Nix. I don't know how that says Lance Nix, but uh, it's a Lance Nix autograph baseball. And finally, for the autograph baseballs, Jeremy Horst, former Cincinnati Red, and also a Philadelphia Philly. Pitched mostly for the Lehigh Valley Iron Pigs. Again, like I said, authentication logo is on that one. You punch in that code on the MLB authentication website, and it'll pop up there. I also have a few uh, little softy balls. Not nearly as nice as the uh, Major League balls. It's a little made in China, unfortunately. These, uh, these are only $3 each and a little cheaper to ship. This is Mick Billmeyer, a uh, coach for the Phils. We've got Eric Kratz. He was the backup catcher for the Kansas City Royals this year. Spent some time in Toronto. Also, former Pirate and Philadelphia Philly. Has the authentication logo. Also has a few unfortunate smears somewhere, I think. Well, I guess it's just right, right there. So that's unfortunate. But like I said, these are cheap. Oh, never mind. Here's the smears. I remember I saw them. So, like I said, $3 on these ones. 3 bucks on uh, these soft ones here. So if you need a signature of a player, there's a chance to get them cheap. John Lannon, former Washington National, New York Met, and Philadelphia Phillies starter. Kevin Franson. He is a reserve infielder slash outfielder for the Washington Nationals. Also a former San Francisco Giant. And you got it, Philadelphia Philly. Kevin Franson there. And finally, he only spent one year as a hitting instructor with the Phils. 
obviously had a really nice uh, career, Mr. Wally Joyner. These uh, clearly aren't quite as nice as the uh, Major League Baseballs, but still, if you're looking for a cheap Wally Joyner autograph, here's your opportunity. So, if there's any interest in any of this, like I said, comment below, uh, send me a private message, uh, like and share, and thanks for watching. Anyway, I'll be back with some more TTM recaps and various other videos soon, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Yeah, yeah, yeah.